hello guys and welcome back to another video um in this video today i'm using fedora 39 running kd plasma now this computer used to be a windows machine but the reason why i switched to linux is because linux seems like a fun hobby to uh, do also a lot of work has happened on it uh, with gaming and valve releasing the steam deck and you know a whole bunch of other uh, linux stuff now i used to like windows a lot but now i don't anymore because i'm s i'm so used to using Linux, I've been using Linux for like months, like five, six months. Like I, I pretty much hate Windows because of like Microsoft account ads in the start menu, uh, bloatware. So I hate Windows, even though I'm literally sitting next to a window right now. Now, okay, I'm using Linux, right? But it looks kind of, eh. Personally, I don't like the way it looks right now. I like the way that Windows 11 looks, uh, with rounded stuff, icons that look like this. You know, pretty much a bunch of stuff around it. So as much as I hate Windows, I like the look of it. So how do I do that in Linux? Well, of course, Linux is very customizable, and I'm using KD Plasma, which is more customizable. So if you guys are using KD Plasma, then you can follow with me today. So uh, click on the menu and then System Settings, and then Appearance. This is where you will be uh, changing the theme, the look and feel of your like Linux experience. Does, does, that, does that make sense? Anyways, in global theme here, uh, click on get new global themes, and then uh, endless. Now I'm going to go with endless here. Apply it. There we go, endless. Now the windows like this is going to look uh, pretty weird, but we're going to change it. In plasma style, um, uh, click here, get new plasma styles, and then search up rounded. Then changes from show highest, show highest rated first. There we go. And then rounded. Uh, let's use this. There we go. It's rounded. Then colors. Uh, okay, it should be on endless. Then Windows decorations. I'll click on this Get New Windows Decorations button and then search Lavanda. Then uh, use this theme. Now it's white, uh, but uh, just go here, click on Lavanda C Dark. There we go. It has these calm buttons now. It's pretty cool. Now go to icons and just enable Windows 11 right here. There we go, it should change the icons, nice. And then splash screen, then click on Windows 11 Endless, or Nord if you want. Um, they look, both of them look pretty awesome. Okay, and anyway, if we have everything we need to change, but we're not done yet, um, the um, background image here, uh, we can just right click on it and then configure desktop and wallpaper. And I'm just gonna select the Windows 11 wallpaper, and okay. If you guys can't find it, then just search up on the internet of the Windows 11 11 wallpaper, uh, right click, save image as, download the image, and then use that image as your wallpaper, or just click add image here and then, yeah. Now I'm going to right click on the menu here, and configure applications launcher, then change the icon to uh, Windows. Nice. Right click on the taskbar, and then click on add widgets, and then search up search. And uh, let's uh, move this. So edit mode, then move it. Now with your search bar here, search up, login screen, here at STDM. Now uh, get new STDM themes, then Windows 11. Uh, show hard is ready first. Should be, okay, right here. Windows 11 dark, STDM. And I've already installed this right here. Uh, click on it, apply. It's already applied for me. But yeah, that was pretty simple. Um, I hope I helped you guys out in this video today. If you guys want, please like the video or uh, sub to the channel. That really means a lot to me. Um, but yeah, that that was the video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.